and I'm delighted to welcome you as the finalists in the Moody's Mega Math Challenge. It has been a dream from the very beginning to create a signature project in mathematics for which the Moody's Foundation and Moody's Corporation could become known. And we are very pleased to have found an extraordinarily competent and visionary partner in the Society of Industrial and Applied Mathematics, which has turned our dream into a well-organized and implemented program. We want to teach kids that they can use math for anything. They don't have to be industrial mathematicians. Uh, they can have careers in financial services, they can have careers in government, they can have careers in many different industries. And I think um, rotating the problems among economic problems, political problems, social problems, um, math problems, um, helps them understand that. We, Siam, really um, encourage people who have quantitative skills and have demonstrated quantitative skills to develop them as far as they can. One of the things that we thought about when we designed this competition was to have presentation skills be part of it because to be successful in business you need more than just the core competencies. I've thoroughly enjoyed the presentations and listening to the presentations with your innovative ideas and very well presented ideas as well. And uh, in addition to industry and academia and the financial sector, there's future careers in government as well for mathematicians and statisticians. And uh, you want to consider that as well. It does help prepare them and it shows what types of projects and problems they can run into in a real world environment as opposed to just learning formulas and, and trying to derive formulas. And plus it um, gets them to work together and develop a presentation which things that they'll have to do and the skills they'll need for the future. Rudy's Mega Math Challenge, six flights, scholarship amount of $2,500, Immaculata High School, Team 161. <laughs>